All the chickens are getting some goodies. Ruby's here to help her mom. Look at these. Look at all these characters. All they can think about is goodies, goodies, goodies. Hi, boys. Hi, boys. Look how big they're getting. Oh, my goodness. Oh, you guys got some kale, too, didn't you? Oh, spinach. It's spinach. Oh, there's a pretty good fly. Hey, everybody. Welcome to our Kentucky home. Papa John here. And my lovely wife, Ivanka. She's giving uh, the chicken some goodies right now. Hope everybody's doing okay. We're going to walk in here, take a look at... See how our see how our babies are doing. Let's take a look. Oh, look at them up on top of the brooder. These are the two new, two that Mama Bird hatched on Saturday. They're doing really good. We believe. I was looking at them last night. Haven't got a close look, but we believe that the the little yellow buff is a hen. And we think this mixed breed boy, we think he's a rooster. Yes, we do. Let's see how, let's see how all of our, oh, look at them. Sitting up on the, these are going to be Hank's girls, all these lavender Orpingtons. They're all doing really well. And the two buffs, we believe that they're both hens as well. They're a little bit older, obviously, than these these little ones. They're, oh, a week and a half, two weeks old now. These other ones, they're about three weeks. And they're looking really good. Let's go out, let's go out and see how, um, how we're doing. I know Ivanka has already collected, hello, boys, has already collected, um, come on. Oh, these boys are just attacking me. Come on, boys. Let's go see what mom's doing. Come on. Where you at, boys? Oh, Ruby, she's just standing out there waiting. Well, the girls lost her dress. Oh, no. We're going to have to put dress back on. I was one of the, thinking about taking them off. One anyway. of the girls is probably this one right here. I was thinking about taking them off anyway. Ivanka said she was thinking about taking her dresses off now. Looks like they're having some goodies. Did you check for an egg? Oh, no, oh, we better go look and see if Princess gives us an egg today. Princess, do you have an egg for us? She had a nice big grady one yesterday. Nope, not yet. No eggs yet. Hello, Ruby. Hello, Ruby. Eat your spinach. It'll make you strong and healthy. Tino. Tino. We're going to take a look. Uh, Ivanka collected 10 eggs already. Um, oh, looks like somebody laid one after. Ooh, a nice one too. That's a big egg. That's a nice one. Got another one, Mom. It was in the far nesting box. Everybody's doing good. Kino, the escape artist, he likes to escape out of the gate. It won't be long. Um, it won't be long and I'm going to be putting this fencing in. Um, I put it off for a little while. I've, I hurt my shoulder a couple of weeks ago and haven't been able to really do much of anything. And it's I, I made it to the doctor finally. I made a couple trips to the chiropractor and finally had to go to the doctor. And I think we've got it sorted out. It's finally starting to feel a little bit better. But uh, so we're going to be before this whole area all the way across here, out here, down through them trees and back up is going to be all run area for the dogs and be able to let the chickens out too to get to the grass and such. I thought we'd walk down here and take a look in Ivanka's greenhouse, see how she's doing her. 
she's got the door open. Must have got pretty warm in there today. Ooh, looks like, oh, I set the alarm off. Looks like her plants are doing really nice. She had reseeded some stuff, and it looks like it's all coming up. These plants are looking really, really nice. Now, a couple of tomato plants that she, she replanted, and some more tomato plants. And she was um, talking about, uh, there's a bunch of the stuff that didn't come up. Talking about she needs uh, some red solo cups from, we actually have a bunch uh, down in the camper we need to go and get. She wants to put some things, some of those, some of that stuff in bigger pots and it won't be long. We're going to get her, get her beds all put together and start getting them out here. And we're actually going to build a few more raised beds to put out here on the property, right out greenhouse here, this area, this ledge here, I believe we're going to use and maybe some of this area and possibly some of this area here next to it where it'll get afternoon shade as you can see it's about 6 p.m in the evening so it'll get some afternoon shade but um it's pretty much clear uh all open so it would get uh quite a bit of sunlight so this might be a real good spot so it doesn't get burned up in the evenings uh, when it gets real hot, it gets pretty hot here in the summertime in the evenings. So So I'm gonna go back up here to uh, Hank His run last night Our lavender Orpington, mr. Hank the big boy there Seems that he spent the night outside because he didn't get himself in the automatic door before before it went down. So we're going to see if we can't set this. And we'll go over here to the close. And we'll lower this even more. That's the light sensitivity. We'll go to two. And reset it. Hello. She's just jumped up on my leg here. And flew back down. These chickens are so friendly. Well, we'll, we'll see if that helps any. That should... Uh, Get it going. Well, that felt really nice. My ring. <laughs> Boy, you guys are something else. Black chicken. We believe that this black chicken here, this old gal, she has a hurt foot. And, um... It's kind of, looks like it's kind of swollen up by her ankle there. Notice she has feathers, hello, she has feathers by her, on her feet. We believe that she has some mor moran in her, and she laid her first egg since being here with us yesterday, and it was really, really dark brown. This one's pecking at my shoe down here. Yes, we see you. <laughs> Hello. I have to go see what Ivanka is. She's hollering at me from down the driveway. I'm. Oh, oh, she's down there waving. Look at her. Oh, she says she has sunflowers coming up. She had planted sunflowers out here with just regular sunflower seeds out of our scratch feed from the chickens and she was telling me to be real careful to where I mow because Thanks. 
Oh yes. Ruby, get out of Come here. on, Rube. These little guys right here are sunflowers. I think that's one. She thinks there. that's one there too. Uh, oh, right here. This is one and one. There. She has another one coming up there. There might be a couple more. I can't really see. Oh, here's one. One there. It's kind of down along the driveway here. She wanted to have. Uh, I told him I could plant it some, but now those were some I got from seed pasture. The ones I planted Big hawk. Out here. I'm not sure if you can see that hawk flying around right there. These would be hard to see because they're hidden down in here. This big guy here, he likes circling around above our chicken coops. I'm pretty sure that's one. Yeah, you have one coming up in here, too. Oh, bless. Yeah, these hawks, if they could get to our chickens. I think this might be one, too, honey. Think you got another one there? Maybe. It's kind of hard to tell. Yep, there's one. Look. Yep, there's one. Oh. Sticking up. Uh. You know, something we have not found yet, walking the property. We have not found any morels yet. We have looked and looked. I've climbed the hillside several times. Um, I'm just not sure if they've popped yet or not. Well, Ivanka's excited. She, uh, she has sunflowers coming up all the way down through here. I think something's nibbling on the leaves. Would, would do rabbits eat sunflowers? Uh, yeah, do, do rabbit eat new shoots of sunflowers? If so, we're in trouble. Yeah. We have rabbits like crazy out here. I may not have any sunflowers. We have a lot of rabbits, and they're very big rabbits, too. They eat a lot. Uh, I'm excited. <laughs> She's very excited. This little area here, It's this is the garage here. Yeah. This is actually a piece of... Uh, piece of the property that we actually have not walked on before so you'll get to come up here with us and somebody had cleared this little section off here and made a trail you see that cave Ivanka said she'd like to go up there and look. It's a big old cave. Um, I can make it. You could make it, but I'm afraid. I mean, I know I can get back down. I can roll down, but I don't know if I can make it up there. Well, you can make it up there. I'm just not sure if the black bear that's probably asleep in there would let you come back. Uh, I didn't bring no protection. <laughs> she didn't bring any bear spray with her, she said. You can see where they cleared this off coming through here. We never have, and we're down on the back side of the garage here. See the road, and you can see some, I'm not sure if you can see those blue pins over there. That's on the neighbor's property. Uh, you see where the road bends, and about where the top of that bend is, our property comes up the mountain. Here it comes up, goes way up there on top of the mountain and across. Oh, she's going to go for it. Here she goes. It's, I, I don't know if you can tell, but it really is steep. It's real steep. She's calling for bear. We'll walk up here. Well, we've made it this close. I'm trying to see if Ivanka has the guts to go up on in there. The guts and I can't get up the hill. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's really just a. Well, Got a little closer. You can see the holes back in there. I'm going to swing down on this grapevine here. In there. Ivanka says she's going to swing back down on the grapevine. It'd be easy to get That ought to be fun to watch. I'm going to hug this tree. She's still working her way down the hill. I got back down here to the path.
come to your left a little bit. There you go. Yeah, you got to watch out for the rattlesnakes too. Where are they at? I'm sure they're here somewhere. Well, we made it back down on the path here. We're going to kind of walk along here. It looks like it goes up around the curve here. She said she didn't break a hip or anything. Looks like they, boy, they, they had their work cut out for them because they cleared this out going all the way around and up the hill. I'm not sure if you can tell or not looking, but there's a big, there's a creek that runs right down through there. Our property line is right on that other bank and comes up this hill. Uphill we go. So we are now looking over this spring that comes down through here. This is the, you can see the neighbor's property over there, but um, the property line, you can see the fence over there uh, runs up through there where you see, kind of see that log there. Um, we own everything this side and you can see that we have a spring. See if I can get down here a little closer. If you can see that, I'm holding it still. That's the spring that comes out on our property here. You can see the water flowing out of it. It comes from the top of the mountain up there. And it flows, let me take this back to regular. Flows right down through our property. And you can see the water down there. And it actually comes out by the road down there and there's a culvert that goes under the road and down over the mountain. So we brought you over to the east end of the property. I did finish walking up that path that goes all the way up on top of the mountain. We don't own up there, just up near the top. And we showed you that spring, which is always handy to have on your property. I'd hate to have to get to it and get water. Well, wouldn't be bad because we would go to it right from the road and, oh, yeah. and just walk, we should have walked in that way. walk right up that <laughs> spring. <laughs> well, hey, thanks for stopping by everybody. We just wanted to share a little bit of our evening with you. It's been a beautiful evening, beautiful day here today in the mid 70s in southern Kentucky. We got to roll back down the hill. We have to roll back down the hill. Um, I do want to, uh, one thing, I want to give a shout out to my grandkids up north. Um, they're always in our heart, and uh, we don't get to see them as much as as we'd like to, but uh, I think the ticks are starting to bite. <laughs> one, like I said, I wanted to give a shout out to my grandkids up north, uh, our precious Evelyn and um, Danny. Trevor and uh, Geo, if you're watching, if you're watching, Grandpa's giving you a shout out, and we're gonna see you soon, buddy. Um, I have uh, several grandkids up north, and uh, we love them all, and uh, we can't we can't wait to see them all the time. Thanks for stopping by. Till next time, God bless. God bless.